I'm just going to hit a drive um, after we have a little chat um, about launch angle and get, making sure that you've got the, the correct angle of attack. Um, hitting up. Rich. Yeah, very much so. Linking into our tip from last week, you can swing it as fast as you like, but if you're not hitting the bite at the middle, it's not going to go as far as it potentially could. And that's the same with your attack angle as well. So if you swing it as hard as you like, but if you're smashing down on the ball and you're hitting down, the ball's going to spin too much and it's simply not going to go as far. So we wanted to get that maybe higher up on the tee, as you can probably see behind us, so you can increase that angle of approach and get that ball launching a little bit higher and spinning left as well. The, the chat I have with a lot of people is when I, I get them to tee the ball up higher, they get worried that they're going to go underneath it and you can see some marks on the top of the paintwork. You can um, on yours, yeah. Uh, there's no marks on there, Richard. Um, <laughs> but, and that's why, because they're hitting down on it. So no matter how high you tee it, if you hit up, you'll never sky it yeah. and you'll launch it properly. Right. If you do maybe get a little bit scared of that roof of the club, pop the ball a little bit further forward in your stance as well. That's only going to help you hit a little bit further up on the ball. Go so on then. Ball forward, left shoulder high. That's going to tilt my... One, I get it. Ball forward, left shoulder high. That's going to tilt my spine slightly back. And then we're just going to just rip one down there. It's mm. a draw, by the way. I think that's the win. No, it's a draw. Nicely done. 